Hey guys, Adam here with americantrucks.com. Today we're taking a closer look at listening to and installing the Corsa 3-inch Sport dual exhaust system with the 4.5-inch black tips available for your 09 to 18 Ram 1500. You should be checking this out for your own 5.7 liter Ram 1500 if you're looking to beef up the exhaust sound just a little bit over the factory option to give you a little bit more rumble, a little bit more aggression, and obviously a better looking rear end with the dual black tips. The sport option here, I am giving a soft two out of five on our loudness meter as you just heard from our sound clips. It's not very overwhelming. At idle, it sounds completely normal and at very low cruising speeds or low RPMs, it doesn't have too much of a bark. Once you start laying into it, you know it's an aftermarket exhaust. It gets a little louder, a little more aggressive, but really not too, too much. Thanks to Corsa's patented RSC or reflective sound cancellation technology in their sport muffler, you can expect absolutely no drone inside the cabin. It keeps that sound clarity, although the volume is not too loud, you won't get any of that raspiness or interior drone. Now with that, you are getting a full 304 stainless steel, which we'll take a closer look at later on, sitting on the floor next to our factory catback once we get that off. The 304 stainless is going to improve 17.4% of the airflow coming through your exhaust as Corsa lets us know. You get 3-inch mandrel bent tubing to streamline the airflow. The 4.5 inch black tips look really good with that dual rear exit mimicking that factory exit style. One thing about those black tips I do want to point out is once they get some heat going through them, so really one or two driving cycles, you'll start to notice they do get that rainbow color which some of you guys might like. That's kind of that titanium diamond black looking tip. If you are looking for just a gloss black tip that does not discolor into that rainbowish tint, this might not be the option for you. But personally, it's not too, too noticeable until you're up close. It does look a lot stealthier out the rear end, and honestly, I do not mind it. If you want to pick up the Corsa Sport dual exit with the black tips for your own truck, you can do so for just over a thousand bucks. That is a price tag to be expected with some of the higher quality materials that Corsa uses since they are one of the more reputable brand names in the category using some of the top materials you can get for an exhaust system. If you're located in wintry weather areas seeing a lot of road salt or some of those climates that could deteriorate an exhaust, something with the 304 stainless steel is the way to go since it will last a lot longer than 409 or aluminized steel respectively. Now if you're trying to get this one installed, expect one out of three wrenches on our difficulty meter, especially if you're using a lift. Now one point I will make is if you are working on the ground with those jack stands, make sure you have them on deck to support the frame. And I would say it might circle into two out of three wrenches on our difficulty meter if you are working on the ground, just because you don't have as much space as we do with a lift, but it doesn't really make the install or uninstall of your factory exhaust any harder. You're just working with limited amount of space. Still, no cutting or drilling or anything like that is involved, no welding. It's a simple bolt-on install. I'm gonna show you guys how to get that done step-by-step, step, so let's get to it. The tools required for this install will be a cordless impact or a ratchet and a 15 millimeter deep socket. Tools recommended would be a mallet, hanger removal tool, and a pry bar. All right guys, because our Ram has a factory dual exhaust, what we're gonna do is disconnect both of our tailpipes from the muffler right behind our rear axle. Now I've got my impact gun and my 15 millimeter socket. A regular old ratchet will do the trick as well, or if you don't have one, a simple wrench also does the trick. So 15 millimeter socket, we're gonna disconnect the clamps right at the end of our tailpipes that connect to the muffler. All right, so now we're gonna take our hanger removal tool and pop each tailpipe out of their hanger isolators. All right, now we can slide the other one out as well. And WD-40 definitely helps here. You wanna lube up those hangers, it will slide right out. All right, now we can loosen up the clamp right behind our muffler inlet. So we finally got our factory exhaust off of our 5.7 Ram on the floor here, sitting next to our Corsa Sport option with the dual black tips. Now, as you can see, there are a lot of similarities, but also a lot of differences when it comes to the two systems. The general size and shape, since we're starting back here, of the muffler is pretty similar, but what's going on inside is gonna make all the difference when it comes to the sound. 
Now the sport muffler here is a straight through muffler that gives you that really loud high performance sound, but it also has Corsa's patented RSC or reflective sound cancellation technology, which is something that helps you reduce all of that drone inside of your cab while giving you clear sound that still has that really good tone that you expect from an aftermarket Corsa muffler. Now making our way out of the muffler, you'll see we got the dual outlets going into that three inch mandrel band tubing that increases up to 17.4% airflow, giving you that bump in power, but also making sure that sound streamlines back to the dual exit. Speaking of which, as we go down, you'll see something that gives you a ton more styling points at the back end over your factory tips. Those are the dual four and a half inch black stainless steel tips. Those go along with the 304 stainless steel of the entire system for anyone who wants that stealthy addition to that rear instead of that polished chrome that you see all over the road. So if you're looking to differentiate yourself a little bit but you love that course of sound, the black tip option is the way to go. That's definitely what I would pick if I was driving around that 5.7 Hemi. Now without further ado guys, I wanna show you how this gets installed. It's extremely similar to the way we took off our factory exhaust, so let's just get to it. Continuing down our driver's side here, we just attached that driver's side muffler outlet that'll connect to both of those hangers above the muffler. Now we're making our way down to the next two isolators. As you can see on this pipe, we have two hangers that'll slide through on those isolators and we'll connect our pipes. All right, next up is our over axle pipe on our passenger side. Now, this is not two pieces like our driver's side, so it'll go all the way from your muffler back to the tip. So we're gonna slide it over our axle, connect our hanger to the isolator, and then connect the tailpipe inlet to the exhaust muffler. All right, last step of the process here is to put on our two four and a half inch black tips. These will slide right over with the appropriate clamp. Make sure they're centered. You wanna make sure these aren't crooked. Make sure that the bolt head on your clamp is facing up. You don't want that dragging down because that's something you will see. So once everything is lined up properly, go ahead and tighten these down. That's gonna wrap up my review, sound clip, and install of the Corsa Sport three inch black dual exhaust system with the rear exit design, which is great for your 09 to 18 Ram 1500 with that 5.7 Hemi motor. Now, if you wanna get a slight increase in sound and aggression from your exhaust, bumping one step over the factory option, this two out of five on our loudness meter option is a great way to go with those stealthy black tips. You can get yours right here at americantrucks.com.